Hi everyone, thanks for clicking on this video. Uh, welcome to your release and receive um, reading. This is really about uh, something you need to release, something you need to receive and an advice for you. All right, so thanks for subscribing. Uh, welcome, thanks all the new subscribers. I appreciate very much you subscribing and you liking these videos so I can post more and more for you. Sorry, I didn't upload in the last couple of days. I was really sick. You can still hear my voice, but um, that is behind me now. And uh, hopefully I'll be able to upload much more. I have beautiful new cards and um, many other ideas of videos for you guys. All right, so thanks for that. And uh, this is, um, those are the same amethyst uh, crystal. And this is just on the tri um uh, pyramid shape this is more on a rough um, state right this uh, is actually one of those small pieces here but obviously from a much bigger um, crystal and this is more in a rough state you can see here it's still the stone behind and so pile number one two or three concentrate go with uh, the one that resonates with you the most with your first uh, gut feeling and think of um, just what advice you need at the moment okay this will be about something you need to release something you, you you're gonna receive you need to receive and advice for you so just concentrate pick one of them and um, the timestamp will be on the description the details of the cards I'm using as well all right so thank you hi group number one if you chose the pyramid amethyst crystal gonna be here for you and this is your first card what you actually need to release okay so this is your first card rose petal all right what this card actually means it's about the things that are actually creating anxiety in your life so you really need to release anxiety at the moment Right? There are things that are going around you that are causing you stress, anxiety, and um, you know it's, it's bringing you to overthinking, maybe sleepless, sleepless nights. And this is about the. It's like um, you reach you reaching a point now that uh, is really causing you trouble, and it's it's about time. You're like, this is it. You had enough right so enough is enough now it's time to release so you need to release this anxiety all right so your time to release is now uh it's not it's easy to say obviously it's not as easy to do there will be the receive card and the advice on some steps of things that you need to do how how can you achieve that you know it's not just saying okay i'm not gonna be anxious anymore it's not it's not like that we know it's not that simple but uh, how can you get into that state of mind how can you release it's, it doesn't mean that's gonna be uh, from one day to the other but it's about uh, taking these steps into the right direction right so the first thing you need to release here just the first card for you the release is anxiety all right and what can you receive what will you receive okay this is your second card here of the receive in every moment the universe is conspiring to bring me towards right-minded thinking and the energy of love this is lovely card guys and it's really about the how do you get to this point how can you release it's really getting into that right-minded thinking remember the universe the higher powers god the angels however you want to call or believe they are on your side they are ready to help you whenever you call upon them whenever you actually allow that help to come sometimes they send people situations that come across you and you may say no to them when they were actually the help that was sent from above and even if they're not people or situations things coming on remember prayer meditation thinking with that right-minded you know that energy of love can come to you 
I always say it can take just five to ten minutes a day. You know, don't think that you need to meditate for one hour, that you need to take so much time. You may say I don't have time. I always say we all have just the same amount of hours during the day. It's just how we choose to spend them. In five to ten minutes, you can just lock yourself in the toilet if you have to. You know, it's when you have your shower. It's when you walk with the dog. Take that time. Meditation. Thinking. Reading. Uh, repeating. Um, write affirmations. Repeat this to yourself. This is an affirmation. You will be able to receive. The, you're going to receive love. You're going to receive the directions. You need to release the anxiety. So you can receive the love, the right-minded thinking, this energy that you need at the moment. So you need to release the anxiety and receive the right way of thinking. It's like there is something blocking at the moment. You're thinking on the on the negative way, on the on the, the like I said, the uh, anxiety and depression. They you know stress. They really bring the negative thoughts and the bad situations can look even worse so this is really about being able to look around them with a different eye you can release this anxiety and you can receive this right-minded way of thinking again okay take your time take the steps don't give up and we do have a the third card here, which I like very much because you have the two sides, you have the, this is the Archangel, Archangels and Gemstone cards. So you have um, an affirmation on the back. So the front one here, the message here for you, the first one is, are you ready to uncover memories or wisdom is stored within your consciousness? Spiral in words to understand your dreams and visions. Recognize the value of the past and use it as a stepping stone for the future. You have much wisdom inherent within you. Use it. Very, very powerful card here, guys, for you. It's really, really telling you, you have the power to change. You have the power. And situations did happen in your past, hard situations, as a step stones, a stepping stones. For you to grow, to get to, a, to your path, to understand, to be able to help others. Many times we, we think we can help someone else, but we really can align with someone and understand where they're coming from when you have gone through the same situation or similar enough issues. So maybe you want to, to get to this point of being able to help others and being able to release all this. Just remember, the hard situations this, that you are living at the moment here in this anxiety that you need to release, they are just stepping stones for this, this lovely future that you can have. You have the power to change. Remember, what are your dreams? What are the things that you really, really want to do? Don't give up. All right? Don't give up. And we do have the other side, which is the affirmation or prayer, however you want to call. This is from the Archangel Jophiel. And it is for you to repeat as well. All right? So, wisdom is stored in my cells and bones. I am conscious of my intelligence. I tap into ancestral knowledge. Meditation comes naturally. I go within for guidance every day. I integrate and process all that I perceive with ease. Very, very powerful card. Very, very powerful affirmation here for you guys. If you want to take like a screenshot for you to repeat, for you to pray, for you to use this affirmation, for you. You have the wisdom. You have the way. To get through this situation at the moment this is your advice here you can do it you have the power it is within 
state meditation. Again, the word meditation is coming here. Take that time for yourself. Like I said, just 5 to 10 minutes a day. It will make a difference. Do it every day and you will see. I guarantee you. Take that time for yourself. Meditate. Positivity. And you will start seeing step by step the anxiety leaving you. It's time to release that. It's time to receive the right mind of thinking. And the energy of love is there for you. You have the wisdom. Everything is coming to you. You deserve it. You deserve to move forward. That's your message for your group number one. Okay? Take a screenshot if you need. The description uh, will be below the links for the cards if you want to have them for yourself. They are beautiful cards to have them. So this is your message. Okay? You deserve you deserve the best. You deserve to be happy. Okay, thank you, group number one. Group number two, if you chose this lovely amethyst rough stone here, uh, this is your reading. I'll leave it right here with the image of. So your first card, what you need to release. All right, so the first card is forgiveness. Okay, I'll put it right here for your forgiveness. Beautiful card. So this card is very clear for me. You needed to release pain, right? It's time for you to think. It's not worthy to be feeling this pain. Forgiveness is time for forgiveness. So many times we go through over and over some situations, something bad that has happened to us. And maybe someone did something really bad to us. We didn't deserve that. We think that, how can you forget that? How can you forgive that person? Forgiveness is not forgetting. We can still think of that situation. But when we forgive, we will think in a different light. We will see that in a different way. We will see that as a way for you to grow. For you to learn how to avoid that kind of person or situation that you have been through so it's time to heal yourself and uh, release this pain so this card is very clear for me and when you release the pain you actually when you forgive you actually releasing yourself because you realize you're a prisoner of that situation, of those thoughts that they don't bring you anywhere. And many times, the person that hurt us, they don't even know that they hurt us or they are not affected anymore. But we are the ones thinking over and over. So we are the ones being hurt over and over. So forgiveness, it's time to release the pain. This card is very clear, very, very clear. It's time to release the pain. And what can you receive? What will you receive? This is your next card, okay? True healing occurs when I give myself permission to feel whatever feelings live below the triggers. True healing. It's time for you to receive true healing. And when do you, do you receive that? Give yourself permission to feel what, whatever you are feeling below the triggers. It's really about understanding that you, you had them, you were right to feel hurt and uh, know that someone caused you so much pain or you feel anger whatever was the feeling you had the right to feel at the time but there's really no point of keep going keep 
going and thinking over and over again of the situation because then you it's like you're reliving reliving the situation you're feeling you're living again reliving is living the same situation over and over being hurt over and over no one needs to live like that forever i don't know how long you're holding on to this but it's time to release this pain forgive and you're going to receive true true healing you deserve this true healing it's time now to move on and you can see and look back with the eyes of understanding and wisdom and thinking how much you you grow with the situation how much you learn how close are the situation bring you to your real path to what you really want to do with your life stepping stones sometimes the the hurt that we we had they're just stepping stones for us to move forward but we cannot just move forward if we reliving and thinking about that over and over we have to first release that pain forgive and then you receive a true healing like i said not forgetting you know what happened you know you didn't deserve it but it did happen so you can move move forward what did you learn with that how can you move forward release release that pain forgiveness now and you receive true true healing we do have a third card here which is the ones i like because they have the two sides here then from the archangels and gemstones and the first side here it's the message is are you ready to move forward with your life you have the courage within you to move ahead with your ideas by getting the wheels in motion to create your project or intention. Recognize the amazing power, powerful person that you are and shine on. Wow, what a powerful, powerful card and very, very clear message here for you guys. It's time. You are ready to move forward now. It is time. Don't you want to move forward? There's no point. There's only hurt if you get stuck here. Reliving over and over again. You know there's no point. It's time to release the pain. Forgiveness now. True healing. Because you are capable. You have the courage within you. It's right there. You're actually inside your heart you have the the feeling you know it's time to move on it's you really know it's not worthy you really know you deserve okay reserve you deserve because it's time for you to recognize recognize the amazing powerful person that you are and shine on there's so much goodness and ways for you to shine in the future so close to you it's just right there just accept this healing release the pain accept receive this true healing and your advice is you can do it it's right there you have the power to change the situation we have the other side here which is an affirmation, a prayer, however you want to call from Archangel Uriel. This is for you to repeat, guys. I am grateful that my vital life force provides me with the energy and mo motivation to live life to the fullest. Financial abundance is mine. My connection with the divine is alive and well. I am energized, healthy and strong. Very, very powerful here very powerful for you to repeat because once it's all released it's all gone you have the true healing you have this amazing potential be grateful 
for that life, that beautiful life that is ahead, is there for you. You can have everything you want, financial abundance, connection with the divine, healthy living energy, feeling is strong. Tell me, don't you want that? You don't want to be feeling over and over this past, this pain. It's time to move on. Okay? You can do it. You have the power within you. And you deserve this. You deserve this beautiful life here waiting for you. You deserve this true healing. And you can do it. It's inside you. Okay? Just understanding you're already a very powerful person. You can do this. All right? Group number two, thank you very much for your time. Group number three, if you chose the small amethyst uh, crystal, doesn't matter how small, it's still very powerful. I'll leave it here with this. So your first card, what do you need to release? Your first card is Seasons of the Heart. All right, these lovely, beautiful design cards, these ones. The Seasons of the Heart actually is telling you about the heart, the things that affect our heart, right? So the things that we let affect, sometimes not even real, but being affected. So this is about releasing fear, okay? So what you need to release is fear. Some things that maybe we don't even realize that uh, we are actually putting so much power on. There are things that don't need it for us to be afraid of, but we are afraid. We are afraid to take that next step, that uh, decision. We don't want to, we are avoiding, um, we are avoiding or the things that we really want to do in life. The, we are avoiding to actually... Uh, show up who we are, what we like. Are we using masks? Are we pretending to be someone we are not just to be around this crowd that we are at the moment, just to be accepted? This is about releasing the fear, the fear of being who you are. And this is really about uh, releasing this fear and accepting who you are, being true to yourself. And uh, being true to who is around you. If they are not going to accept for you for who you are, they don't really need to be in your life. Maybe it's time to cut some people off. Maybe it's time to move from that job that you don't like, but you're afraid because you're afraid of not having money. You're afraid of opening your own business and uh, not being able to, you know, to pay your bills. I understand it's not uh, easy. Make uh, cautious decisions, but don't hold back. Don't just be holding yourself forever because of fears that things that didn't even happen yet. Fear is something that is really about what's in our minds because it, it didn't even happen yet. We are afraid of something that didn't even happen. So it's in our minds. So it doesn't exist. If you think about it, it's time to release the fear. All right. And your next card is what will you receive? This beautiful card here. And the message is, In any moment, I can surrender to the powerful presence of love through prayer, contemplation and stillness. Beautiful card here, guys. This is about what you can receive. You can receive love and joy. You deserve love. In any moment, any moment, you can surrender this fear and be powerful again. Receive this powerful presence of love. You have the higher powers on your side. You actually can just surrender and you will receive this love. You will receive how? Through prayer, meditation, stillness. Five to ten minutes a day. I always say that. It doesn't need much. We all have 24 hours a day. Just take that small time when you're in the shower, when you are 
walking your dog, when you are in the toilet, when you are just uh, between your breaks at work, five minutes, ten minutes, guys, is all it takes. Just be consistent. Do it every day or as much as you can. And you will be able to release the fears. Think about it. Why are you afraid, really? Something didn't even happen yet. You know, you deserve to be yourself. You deserve to be happy. You have to release the fear and then you make room for all the love and joy. You can receive love and joy. Okay, it's there for you. You deserve it. And this last card is the Archangels and the Gemstones. I like because they have the two side messages. And the first side here is so, so connected, you guys. The message is, do you need to recapture your personal power? Sorry about my dog, guys, walking around. Do you need to recapture your personal power? Surround yourself with people who recognize your talents, intelligence, creativity, kindness, and thoughtfulness. The appreciation will amplify your goodness. Share your inner wisdom and beauty. It is time to reclaim and amplify your personal power. Very, very powerful here, guys. It's time to amplify your personal power. It is time. Release the fear. Take the leap of faith. You have so much love and joy waiting for you. Who are you surrounding yourself with? Are you afraid of who they will think you are or if they are not going to be your friends anymore or your family? Um, you just need to be yourself. You just need to be happy with who you are and other people will accept you. You know, sometimes we are afraid of what they will think what they will do, but when we actually true to ourselves, we realize they, they don't mind. They actually love you from who you are, for, for being honest, for being true to yourself. So this is really about surrounding yourself with the right people as well. And if you have to cut down some people, maybe that is the case as well. I'm not saying get rid of everybody, of your family, but just pay attention who is around you. Who is that person? Maybe that is one person causing you this fear. You know, it's time to think about that. And you understand that you are so powerful. You know, depending on who you are, um, um, putting yourself with, uh, you know, surrounding yourself with, you actually can feel that they, they help you out. They, they bring the best of you. You know, they amplify your goodness. So they they help you to be more powerful. Who are really your friends? Who really love you and want the best for you? They are not jealous. They are not uh, thinking you, you're more powerful than them. Competition. If none of that exists when they are true friends, true love there. They want the best for you. And... Uh, there is no competition, guys. We are unique. We, everybody has their own talents. Just think of... Take your power back. Release the fear. Receive the love and joy. It's there. You deserve. It's there for you. You are powerful. Surround yourself with the right people. What is the back message here? Is a prayer affirmation. Okay, in this case for Archangel uh, Jophiel. For you to repeat as well i am a shining star i focus on all my good attributes and amplify them i see my path shining brightly before me i have the courage to step forward with joy and enthusiasm i help others as i radiate my magnificence very very powerful affirmation prayer guys for you this is really about you being able to focus and realize you are a shining star. You have talents. You can help yourself and you can actually help others. That's what I see here in this card. You have so many good things that amplify 
amplify them. Amplify so much that they they expand. Expand so much that you can help others. Alright, so this is very, very powerful. Group number three. This is your reason. Reading. Release the fear. And there's so much more, so much more for you. Alright? So if you made this far, thank you very much for your time. And uh, you have a blessed healing day. Bye.